Like a lot of times as it gets warmer here where we live, we label that as something like, especially towards the side, it's almost unbearable. Or something as negative. But actually when we do yoga or we practice on our mat, we're actually seeking to build heat inside the body. Because it's healing. So my things you practice today is you feel the heat, both from the inside and the outside. Remember that you're healing the body from the inside out. So take one more huge breath in. And on the exhale, big J. Good. The next time you inhale, bring yourself to tabletop position. Bring your hands out underneath your shoulders, knees underneath the hips. From here, I want you to wag your tail to the left. Look over your right shoulder. Inhale, come through center line. And on the exhale, take your eyes to the left, to the right. And then do that again, wagging through center line. Hips left, eyes right. Go ahead and switch the shape. As you come back to center, walk your hands to your knees, press your chest forward, pull your chin up, and on the exhale, press into your hands, nail the spine, chin to the chest. So it's a little bit more like a standing cat cow, and you know, lift the chin, lift the arms. And on the exhale, move. Do that two more times, belly dropping, lifting, breathing, squeezing the shoulder blades together. And exhale, down. One more time to your top. One more long exhale out. From here, I want you to take your left hand to your left hip. Reach your right fingertips up and over. Look over your left shoulder. Good. Then, like a paintbrush with your fingertips. Paint towards the other side, right hand, right hip. Reach your left fingertips up. Take it in your hands. And on the exhale, puppy pose. Reach your fingertips out. Reach your chin forward and drop your shoulders down. And then inhale, press your hips forward to that modified plank. Exhale, pull your hips back, puppy pose. Either your left hand to your hip or your heel this time. Inhale, the right fingertips go up for half panel. And then we exhale, switch to the other side. So remember, hip or heel, it doesn't matter. What it matters is that you're opening your body without crunching too much in your spine. So reach, puppy pose, chin down, hips up. Inhale, press yourself forward, high plank. Exhale, puppy pose. Left hand to heel, and the other right foot and tips go up. Exhale, swim to the other side. This time, as you come into puppy pose, option to curl your toes underneath you. And then inhale, press into high plank. Yeah. And then exhale, puppy pose. Last time, inhale, lift the right foot and tips. Feels so good in the morning, yeah? Big stretches in the spine as you switch sides. This time everybody's still stay underneath them. Puppy pose, your exit. And then on the inhale, press yourself forward. And then hover the knees and press your chest forward. And then hover the knees. So you're going from turbo puppy pose, awesome, to plank. You should feel some heat building in your thighs and your quadriceps. And then pressing your knuckles and your chest forward. Hovering. Good. And pressing. You have eight. You have seven. Good. Go for six. Press for five. Pull for four. Reach those four for three. Awesome. For two. And then after one, I want you to press back and hold puppy pose. So your knees are bent, your shins are parallel to the mat. Your shoulders down, your spine over, and you're feeling your body boil over here. Three breaths right there until down, down. For two more breaths. And on the exhale, pedal your legs left and right, just finding light, finding breath, trying to move. You have a lot of freedom in your body right here. And then just hold fingertips red and white. Heels pressing lower, hips rising. Goals pressing you all the way back to your breath. As we breathe in more deeply, and we exhale more completely. When you get there, inhale, lift the heels, look forward. 
of the exhale, step or float feet to the top of your mat. Inhale, take your hands to your shins, lift to the light, and out halfway. Exhale, chest of the thighs forward. Fold today, I want you to bend your knees. Your spine is dangling, and then look to your nose, sorry, to your navel or your toes as you round the spine all the way up. Good, when you get to the top, like inhale, breath, push the palms up. On the exhale, right hand drops as you reach up and over to the right, a little pulse right there too. So don't pulse from your low spine, pull the belly in, and pulse from the side body right here. Perfect, one, three, two, and one. Inhale, come back from center, and exhale, pulse on the opposite side. So Donnie, you heeded my words of advice, and if you be there or be square. I said third more. That's good. It's really, it's really, you know, it's like Confucius. Three, two, and then press your palms together, press your hands forward, lean your chest up and back. Exhale, wide arms as you hinge and forward fold. Inhale, take your hands to your shins, look to lengthen halfway. And on the exhale, high to low push up, chaturanga. Inhale, forward and through to upward facing dog. Now look past the tip of your nose and then draw your nose to your toes as you wave your spine back behind you. Now facing dog. Three bats right there. Heels down, hips up. Up your shoulders, lengthen your elbows. Inhale, lift the heels, eyes go forward. And on the exhale, step or float towards the top of your mat. Inhale, outside your pinky toes or your shins with your hands. Exhale, chest of the thighs, forward fold. We rise, we reach up, big inhale, left. Again, on the exhale, just a little taps over to the right, squeeze it, it's like a side body crunch. Go four, and three, and then two, hold one. Inhale, come back to center. And on the exhale, up and over, left. And squeeze it, and four, three, two, hold one. Palms press, thumbs cross, eyes lift, chest back, and good. On the exhale, wide arms hinge and forward, forward. Inhale, lift up, lengthen, <laughs> lift and lengthen. Exhale, strengthen, low push up. Sometimes my speech is not awake at seven o'clock in the morning. Inhale, upward facing dog is when I store my words. Exhale, downward facing dog. Two breaths right here, big breaths in. And low breaths out. Good, again, breathe in. And breathe out. Inhale, lift the heels, eyes go full. On the exhale, snap, float, crawl to the top of your mat, sending a lift. Exhale, spill, forward, fold, press down, rise up, inhale. On the exhale, side body, press, only three reps, two, hold one, inhale, back through center. Exhale, just find that little depth for two, hold the one. Inhale, palms press, eyes lift, chest goes up and back. Wide arms as you forward, fold. Inhale, halfway lengthen. And on the exhale, strengthen, low you go, chaturanga. Inhale, we call this Urdhva Mukha Svanasana. And then if you take it to Adha Mukha Svanasana, that would be your Sanskrit for your places there. When you're ready, heels lift, we're getting a little bit faster. On the exhale, step or float to the top of the mat, two more rounds. Inhale, lift and lengthen, halfway. Exhale, forward fold, press root, rise, roll a little bit taller. And on the exhale, just two breaths. Two, hold one, inhale, climb back through center. Exhale, shh, and shh, inhale, all the way up. Exhale, still forward fold. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, strengthen, elbows to ribs, heels and chin forward. And then look past the tip of your nose, and then look toward your toes. We have one more flow. Inhale, lift your heels. On the exhale, step or flow. Your feet to the top of your mat. Inhale, lengthen halfway. Exhale, forward fold. Root rise and reach all the way up. On the exhale, just one tap to the right. Inhale, come back to the center. And then lean to the left. Palms press hard on the rise here. Exhale, find your angel wings. Forward fold. Inhale, lift and lengthen halfway. Exhale, high the little push up, chaturanga. Inhale, forward and through to upward facing dog. Exhale, to downward facing dog. Hold right here for four, for three, for two. And then on the inhale, come into high plank, high plank. Okay, so from here, you're just gonna turn the music off for a second. You're gonna hold high plank. Now, we have a little, or 
Hi, me, I, where your sculptor is. I have a little bit of a uh, thing I like to do. Now we're going into cardio, but it is somebody's birthday today. And it's Tiffany's birthday. So, in the tradition of warrior sculpting, you're gonna sing her happy birthday. Mindy knows, she's shaking yeah. her head and then Amanda does. <laughs> you're gonna sing happy birthday as you do mountain climbers to, to uh, Tiffany. And then she is actually turning 22 today. I know she looks 21. So then you're gonna count out 22 mountain climbers for her 22 years on this earth. You ready? Yep. Yeah. Here you go. Three, two, one. Happy birthday to you. I need to sing louder. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Tiffany. Happy birthday to you. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. And then take your knees down. And give her a round of applause yeah. for another trip yeah. around the sun. Yeah. Happy yeah. birthday! Oh I knew goodness. just what to get oh you. Because <laughs> it's just what I would want too. <laughs> and then you still have a little bit more cardio. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Every so, yeah. If you thought it was just the birthday song. It's not. <laughs> so when you're ready, downward facing dog. Downward facing dog. Good. Come here. Inhale, high plank, and tap left and right, right here. We'll start with plank jacks. When uh, Lady Gaga and Ariana Grande hit that beat, tap, tap right here for eight, for seven. Good, good. For six, think of yourself flying into the mat. Good, good. For four, for three, yes, yes, for two. Awesome, on one, jack right here, out and in for eight. I'm obsessed with this song for six. So it's gonna be on my playlist for the next five years, that means. For four, for three, you're gonna jump forward, high knees, and two, on one. Make it rain with sweat right here. Let's go, 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 go. Push, 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 push. See, if I like a song, because I'm that current, I like to use it for half a day. That's what I like to do. Up, 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 the four, three, two, tap, jump right here. We take it left and right and left and right. Now, if you want to, a little hop. Awesome, little hop. You have eight. For seven. For six. That's a lot of formation in the morning. Five. You got it. Four. For three. For two. Awesome, one, jack in that right here. For eight. For seven, fast feet. For six, five, four, three, two. Let's go. This is our main dance for an NFL season, yeah? For eight, yeah. For six, but you know what our rain dance is for the Golden Knights? It speed skaters to the side here and out right here. Let's go. Up and down. You don't have to jump it, you can step it. We're good, that's all. Awesome. You have eight, for seven, for six, for five, you got it, four, for three, for two, awesome, back to your step touch on one right here, step touch, step touch, now punch, and punch, punch, and punch, and punch, and punch, you got it. Now Eric, one of my friends that comes to my 1045 classes, is an ex Kansas City chick. Am I trying to get you the ticket? <laughs> awesome. <laughs> for four. I have actually in that same class another Eagles shirt, right? For two. Awesome. Now Mike is coming to the show. <laughs> 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 I was like, I'll be his off the there. Let's take high knees to finish right here. Go for eight. Seven. He's like. <laughs> Kids can take care of themselves. Three, two, care of the top. Make the moms in my heart. Make the low million. I hate to have to check in my classes anymore. You always have to realize it's like you're doing a horrible combination. Take it down, squeeze your knees down, squeeze your palms. So I really want you to get into the back and you can lift up. You can really inner thighs zip up and your belly button starts to light up. You got eight. Good, good. For seven. Yes, yes, six. For five, hold squeeze, low down here. For four, for three, 
Pulse five, for four, for three, two, on one. Cross to the left elbow, six, for five, for four, for three, for two, hold the one, and shift six, side, for five, for four, for three, for two, and hold one. Step the foot wide. Inhale, the right fingertips go tall. We call that dragon like this again. And then exhale, tuck that weight underneath the armpit. Yeah, so right weight to the armpit. Drop your back heel. Warrior two. I just want you to come into that safely. Yeah, that is fine. And then on the inhale, on the exhale, take your left knee to bend towards the back of your back. On the inhale, push that foot. Push your knuckles over your chest and you drop the back knee. Exhale, then bounce into low push-up. Chaturanga, yes. Inhale, forward and through the upward facing dog. Exhale, to downward facing dog. Inhale, your left toe high and pause for six, for five, four, three, two, left and right elbow for six, for five, for four, three, two, same elbow for six, for five, for four, for three, for two, hold one, step the foot wide. Inhale, the left fingertips go up. On the exhale, tuck that left knuckle under the armpit, drop the back heel, then press wide into warrior two. Good. On the exhale, take it to the back of your mat, bend your right knee into skandasana, and then move that forward. Inhale, the right knee drops as the arm lifts. Exhale, high to low push up. Chaturanga, you're doing amazing. Inhale, forward and through the upward facing dog. We'll trim it a little bit more. Downward facing dog. Three breaths, we have a four count this time. For two more breaths. Inhale, heels elevate, eyes go forward. Exhale to the top of your mat. Inhale, half my right foot. And exhale, soften. Bend your knees, hands to heart. We take it four, three, two, heels and arms. For four, three, two, five your wings. For four, three, two, hold. And then exhale forward, pull you much more quick. Inhale, lengthen half foot. Exhale, strengthen, low push up. Chaturanga. Inhale forward and through that upward facing dog. Exhale to downward facing dog. Right toe for four, three, two. Elbow for four, three, two. Same elbow for four, three, two. Step it wide. Inhale your right fingertips go tall. Exhale, tuck the weight under your armpit. Warrior two, exhale. On the inhale, step back. Oh, sorry. Reverse warrior. On the exhale, sit back. Exhale, spend awesome. Drop your left knee. Inhale, lift your arms. Exhale, high to low push up. Chaturanga. Good. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale to downward facing dog. Inhale, your left toe up for a four count. Inhale, four, three, two, opposing elbow, four. Three, two, same elbow for four, three, two, step up, foot wide, inhale, left fingertips go tall, exhale, tuck under the armpit, warrior two, right hand to your hip, inhale, reverse warrior, I forgot this the second one, exhale, then skandasana into your right hip, move over your left shoulders, press your knuckles all the way up as you press your knee all the way low, exhale, low push up, do one more round, right and left, inhale, upward facing dog, Exhale, building that healing heat in the body. We actually call that tapas in yoga. Inhale, lift your heels. And on the exhale, step or pull up to the top. Inhale, lift and lengthen half way. Exhale, forward fold, bend your knees. We count for two, one, heels, arms, two, one, knuckles back, two, one. Exhale, forward fold, right and left, half way left. Exhale, low push up, chaturanga. Inhale, forward and through. You can feel that breeze from right over your face. Yeah, exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, your right toe high. Two, one, left elbow for two. One, right elbow, two, one, step wide. Inhale, your right arm goes up. Exhale, tuck it underneath your armpit to warrior two. Inhale, reverse while your right toe goes up. Exhale, sink into the left hip. And then move back over your right body as your arms come up. Exhale, low push up, chaturanga. Inhale, forward and through the upward facing dog. <laughs> Exhale, the downward facing dog. Inhale, your left toe high. We pulse for two. One, opposite elbow. Two, one, same elbow. Two, one, step it wide. Inhale, left leg high. Tuck it under for warrior two on the exhale. 
right elbow to the in, left arm comes up. When they exhale to your heart, bend into your right knee. Move over your left shoulder. Inhale your arms and your knee drops. Exhale, hide a little push up. Chaturanga. Inhale, forward and through the upward facing dog. Exhale to downward facing dog. Walk your feet right underneath your hips. Good. With a flat spine, take your hands to heart and inhale, come all the way up. Beautiful, just little pulses right here. Pick it up, up, and lift. So, with the express class, it's about 45 ish minutes. We're just getting after it. No rest. Slowly work. Yeah. Up, up, and lift. And from here, I just want you to start to hover your left knee a little pulse. And, and Johnny, I have smaller weights if you need them. Please get hard right here. So what's we're working for fatigue. Ooh, awesome. My arms are already hurting. Three, two, on one. I want you to balance, taking your knuckles down, taking your toes back, and then just tap and squeeze. Now, if you need to, you can kickstand your left toe on the ground, or you can tap your toe down and up and lower and lift. For eight, squeeze your booty. For seven, it's my new word, six, <laughs> since Tuesday. Awesome, you got it. Four, for three, yes, yes, for two. Awesome, on one, drop and lift right here. For eight, seven, little pulse for six. For five, for four, three, two. Swing your left toe onto the mat, bring your elbows in, bring your knuckles back, little tap right here, up, down, up, down. Now. Immediately, I went to my low back. I lost my belly, went to my low back, and I felt it right above my hip line. Pull your belly in so you feel it in your core, less than your own spine. There's eight, seven, six, five, four, four, three, two, pulse up, pulse down, you got it. Eight, yeah, yeah, seven, welcome back, six, <laughs> for five. I mean, welcome back, for four, <laughs> for three, good, good, for two, Awesome, sweep your arms right face and pulse right here. Up, down, bend your knees. Remember, don't wear this in the low spot, right? Bend your knees, tuck your core. Little lift, little speed right here. So we're gonna balance on our left foot. For four, three, two, left foot. Right knee goes up, up, and squeeze. And press, just finding that balance, having to use the core to find it. Eight, seven, six, five, for four, three, Two more. I, I think I cued wrong. You should be on your your right foot. Should be on. I cued wrong. So right knee lifts, right? The balance here. Yeah. Okay, right knee lifting. Beautiful from here. Yeah, swim back, but this time the elbows stay wide as you row it down. I start to stay narrow as you row it down. So narrow rows right here. Remember, if you want to kickstand and just hold right here for more balance, awesome. You're going to still definitely feel. If you want to take the leg with the arms, you can right here. For eight, it's your choice. What completes your practice and your intentions? Eight. For seven, you got it. Six. For five. For four, yeah, yeah, that burn. For three, we'll pulse. And two. Awesome, hold the elbow. One, two, tiny, you squeeze it. Times for eight, we'll drop that right toe moment to bring in seven. And six. And five. And four. And three. Two, bend that left knee, take the right toe down, extend the arms, this time knuckles up, low belly in. Remember, make that adjustment, making your hips go a little lower as your hips tuck a little bit deeper, protect the spine for eight, seven, for six, for five, for four, three, two, palms up, palms down, and finish, eight, good, good, for seven, for six, we're gonna take this into a set of push-ups. Yay, yay, four, yay. For three, so excited, for your birthday, Tiffany, two. On one, drop your weights, take your hands down. We're gonna take it down to the ground, and then up, down dog, take it down to the ground, and then up, down dog, take it down to the ground, and then up, down dog, eight more, down to the ground, up, down dog, seven more, down to the ground, up, down dog, six more, down, down, and up, down dog, five more, down, to the ground. Up, down, down. Only four. Down. You're over halfway done. Three more times. Take it down and down. And lift. Fight four. Even if you need to drop to your knees. Good. One more. Take it down towards the ground and then just fall to the ground. Lift the toes. Kick right here. Inhale two. Three, four. Squeeze your elbows back. 
like little grasshopper wings. Now when you're ready, start to float the palms off the mat. Exhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, one more. And then the left arm is going to extend. Exhale, two, three. Left arm forward, right arm back. Look to your right fingertips. Exhale, two, three, four. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, one more. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three. And switch right arm forward. Left arm back. Look to your left fingertips. Inhale, two, three, four. And exhale, two, three, two more. Inhale, two, three, four. And exhale, two, three, one more. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three. Toes down, hands behind the head. Up and down. And lower. Eight. So finish seven. Yes, yes, for six. Good, good. Five. Push your fingertips into your knuckles when your elbows wide and high. For four. Yes, yes, three. For two. On one, take your hands down, inhale, high plank. Exhale, down dog, left, left, right here. Left, left, right, right, good. We're gonna go straight into um, lower body. Not too much balance, we already did that. But then do the abs in the, in the lower body. So from here, inhale, lift the heels. On the exhale, step or float outside your pinky fingers. Inhale, lift the legs in halfway. Exhale, chest to your thighs, forward fold. Take your weights up, perpendicular to your mat. You can even press your palms on them as you drop your hips. Down and hand up. So with your chest lifted and your um, hands a little higher, you have a little bit more room in the body to work your hips maybe to the depth of your hip crease, right? Awesome, and lower. And lift four more for four. Good, good, for three. Now listen, this is gonna feel weird for a moment too. On one, let me see all your weights. Yeah, you can do this. You're gonna take your weight, you're gonna stack it underneath your left heel. Take your right hand to your heart, down and up an inch right here. Down inch and up. Oh, so make sure you have it kind of on that top part of your heel. If your heels look anything like mine, they're very, very tough. Down and up for eight. For seven. My feet saw one pedicure in the last. No, just like my hair. Awesome. For four, and lift. For three, getting a little slower here. For two, awesome. Hold the one, lift the weight in the right arm, and pause for eight. Seven, for six, we're gonna tap your weight to your weight. And four, and three, and two, hold one, here we go. We're gonna tap and reach. Tap, ooh, and reach. You have eight. Seven. Why is it so slow? Six. It's always harder when it's slow. Awesome. For four. For three. For two. And on one, take your weight. Switch it to your left hand. Take your other weight over to your left heel. From here, left hand to your left weight. We take it down and up. Making this burst just as slow as the first as you lift. One more time. For eight. Seven, get lower for six, for five, awesome, for four, for three, for two. And then when your arms go up, the hips drop lower and lower right here. Eight, oh yeah. Seven, good, good for six. Ooh, I know that left arm is starting to feel two. Four more times for four, three, two. Take your hands in your arm, pause for eight, seven, six, five, for four. Three, two, down and up an inch right here. Take it down inch and up an inch and lower and left. Last eight, two, last seven. Weights are gonna go to the ground for six. Awesome, for five, I know, I know. For four, I'm feeling it too, right there with you. For three, yes, for two. And then on one, drop your left leg. Take your right weight right there. Step your left foot back and back and forward. Forward, and then drop your hips, lift your arms. So you go back, back, forward, forward, drop your hips, lift your arms. Good. Alternate the way your body's moving. So starting with left, left, and then moving to right, right, right here, right, and left, and right, and left. Arms go forward, left side, left, right, left, and forward. Now you can keep this as we move to the right, right, left. Or after this last one, you can make it a thruster. Shuffle forward and back. Take it forward, 
more option to jump in. Six times. Good. For five. Your heart should be going boom, boom, boom. Four. For three. For two. Awesome. Jump forward. Have a seat. Drop your weights. Boat pose. Yeah. I just thought your legs were getting tired in here. Yeah, I think we can like figure out the coordination. Yeah. <laughs> Must be harder. That's not always true. Like if somebody's body doesn't have that range, it's actually better to step and you're gonna get a harder workout. Just step in. So I really like to take away the like more or less idea of my class. There's just layers. That's all there is. Just like so like another layer to this would be low belly. Yeah, and that's pretty fun. So your low belly is scooping, your squeeze, inner thighs are squeezing to help support the core. You have four, three. Drive your right knee to your, sorry, left, right, left knee to your right hand. Left knee to right hand. Take your left hand outside the ankle. Stop the single leg extension. Knee, take an inhale. Inhale. Head, exhale. Exhale. Take it. Inhale. So your opposite hand is always to that opposite inner knee. The same hand is always to the same outer ankle. Take it. Inhale. And inhale. Exhale. This ever bothers your cervical spine. Your neck. So hold down dog, inhale your right toe high, then it's gonna go all the way down and up. Tap the ground and lift for eight and lift for seven and rise for six. Awesome, for five, you got it. Four, for three, good, good, for two. Hold the up on one big inhale, take your right knee to your left elbow, this time down the wrist and up four times, down the wrist and up three times, down the wrist and up two times, down the wrist and up, one more, down, hold it, same side, we go four and lift for three, they go fast, good for two, awesome, hold the up on one, step the right foot wide, take your right knuckles all the way up to the ceiling, it's lateral skull pressure right here. Bed extends on the elbow, so the elbow stays pinned in place. Like on a, your, your elbow is pinned to your bulletin board. And then you only move for that elbow joint. For eight, and lift. For seven, and reach. For six, and press. For five, and lift. For four, and rise. For three, very good. For two. Awesome, hold your arm long, that's your inhale breath. Then move your arm right by your ear, reach your right in front of you, take it, inhale, exhale. Remember I told you you do this later on with the weight. Take eight, or seven, little cardio push. There's not a big cardio push at the end of this 45 minute class, so we're getting it in right here for eight. Seven, I think I said eight like 15 times ago. For four, three, two, on one, step back. Tuck your weight underneath you. Take your hands to heart. It's bent, extend, and lower, and lift. So it's on warrior two. Really pumping the arms. Again, it's not a long set. So we're gonna dig in super deep. Right here for eight. Good, good, for seven. Yes, yes, for six. For five, all those shoulders, yeah. For four, good. For three, that means you're doing it right. For two. Beautiful. On one, drop your weight down to the ground. It's down. Robin put down, left elbow back. Down, right left is forward. Down, left elbow back. Down, punch and forward. For eight. Good, good. For seven. So you're seeing your heart rate being up and then over. Rise again. For four. For three. Good, good. Two. 
Awesome. On one, take the up. Take your left hand to your hip. And then with your right arm, you're going to come up by your ear and then down by your shoulder. This is your reverse warrior. Up, up, exhale, exhale, inhale, inhale. It's super shoulder heavy today. You ever need to drop your weight? Absolutely. Exhale, exhale, three more. Up, up, down, down. Two more. Up, up, down, down. One more. Up, up. As you come down, take your weights together. Shift that weight over to the left side. We're going to tap the ground for two. High up for two. So straight arms down for two. It's almost like a kettlebell swing right here. Down, down, and lift, lift. Take it lower, lower, and then on the rise right here. Take it down, down, good. Up, up, three more. Lower, lower, and lift, lift. Two more. Down, towards the ground, and up. One more. I want you to take it down and then just come up an inch with your shoulder blade tension again. Really flat spine. Really smile your heart forward. Squeeze your heart with your chin. Awesome. And four. Little booty. And three. Awesome. You're going to keep your weights together. And two. Hold one. Shift the weight forward. Left knee is hovering. You're going to take it up for two and then by your ears. Beautiful. Take it up for two and then down the silhouette of your ears. Take it up for two. And then down the silhouette. Five more up, just hovering that back leg, letting it suffer a little bit. Take it up for two and down. Two more. Take it up for two and down. One more. Take it up for two. This time it falls all the way down. You ready to do the other side? Let's finish this workout. High to low push up. Inhale up or facing dog. Exhale to downward facing dog. Toe tap right here for eight and lower for seven. You have three more working minutes of this workout. Take it up and down for four. Good, good for three. I try not to hit my wagon. For two, awesome. Hold it up on one. Right knee, left, left knee, right elbow. Take it four and lift all the way down to the wrist for three. For two and lift. Last one more time. You have four, same side. Four and lift. Get them over with right three. For two, awesome, hold up on one, step the foot wide, bring the left leg up, and then bolt in for the elbow, right, pin it in place, eight, for seven, good, good, for six, for five, we got it, four, for three, remember we're going to swim our circle, that arm right by your ear, get into our delt, hold the up on one, take your arm right by your ear, and then take it in and out, you have eight, you have seven, good, good, six, for five, little cardio pump right here, for four, three, two, take it long, but take the arm, hold it under the armpit, come all the way up to warrior two, open, close, open, and close, all that left side, yeah, the left side's feeling a little bit more pressure than the right, lower, and left, for eight, you almost there, for seven, good, good, for six, Make sure you're pressing your left knee a little to the left. For three, good, good, two, Robin Hood on one. Take it together, you can take it down and up. You're feeling your heart rate on the rise right here. Take it lower, push lift. Right elbow, back left knuckle, four for seven, and rise. For six, almost there, guys. For five, for four, for three, two, awesome. On one, take your left arm forward, up, and extend the right down, down. Good, you have about 32 more counts of class. Take it down, down, and up, up. Four more, down, to the ground, and lift, lift three more, soften, and press. Two more, and exhale, inhale, one more, exhale, and then inhale, bring your weights together. One more up, up, and 
and then hold that down, up and down, and then play here for eight breaths there. For seven, open to the right, for six, for five, you got it, for four, for three, for two, awesome, on one, keep your weights together, sweep your arms forward, this time instead of coming up and around, you're going to take the weights up by your ears and around right here, like a choo-choo train, up and around, good, beautiful, up and around, covering that back knee a little bit deeper for four, up and around, for three, remember working mobility in the body, not just strengthening, for two, Good. Last one. We'll take you all the way to the ground for your last chaturanga. Inhale, forward and through the upward facing dog. And on the exhale, the downward facing dog. Inhale, elevate the heels. On the exhale, step up foot to a seated position at the top of your mat. Good. Come here. Little thoracic circles up and to the right. Let's do this. Ooh, how are we doing? Yeah, it's like, what even happened? And then you're done. Ooh. I always want to go longer. <laughs> I like my time with you. I love my time I with you guys. <laughs> and Mandy's like, yeah, you're weird. <laughs> Inspire me. Yeah. Take your hands down. Take your knees down. Take your hips up. The hip flexor stretch and the shoulder stretch. Good. And then drop the hips. Take the feet together. Knees better quite wide. Two options here. Hands can go behind the hips, pressing your chest forward, or you can grab your toes, still pressing your chest forward. Then forward fold, try from your rib cage higher instead of your low back lower. So inhale, find one breath of lengthening, and then feel your rib cage and try to dive from there and not your low spine. And head drops. Just breathing. your toes, just gently press that away from you, and find that roll up that we did at the beginning of the class, so just like to see, and then cross your shins, and inhale your arms up, one time just tap your left fingertips behind your spine as you reach over your right knee, left knee, inhale, come up, this way. and exhale, just to twist to the opposite side, and then as you inhale, lift your arms up, and then gather your hands to your Close your eyes. Just a moment of gratitude. For me to you for this amazing grace. Gratitude for Tiffany's another year on the sun. Gratitude for just being just here and now in the space that you have created. So I'm grateful for you all. Namaste. Awesome job. Yeah. Oh, I love these. You know, it's funny. Like, my alarm goes off, and I'm not like, on these mornings, I'm not like, oh. I like spring out of bed. I'm ready for y'all. And that's really actually very unlike me. Like, usually I'm like, oh, I'd like to like lay here for another, you know, or snooze it, or I jump out of bed for you guys. So, y'all must be doing. I, I swam for too many years waking up at like five o'clock for practice. And there's not a lot 